Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. Let's uh, take a look at Bluefish Editor. I didn't have much luck before, but hopefully I'll have more luck this time. <clears throat> Two things I really needed to do is highlight my code. And so the easiest way to do that is by first saving it. Alt File, Save As. I know it sounds funny, but that's the case. I'll just go ahead and save it as uh, Test HTML. Save. I'm going to overwrite it. And the first thing I need to do is start typing HTML, right? Like that. Now, you'll see that the code is uh, highlighted, and that's because I saved it first. If you don't save it, then you don't get the highlighting. Next thing I want to do is show you how I modified the font size because I don't like tiny fonts because uh, then I have to wear my glasses. So I'm going to bump up the uh, mono space to 16. Click OK, click Apply, click OK, and then it'll close. So that's a little better for my eyes. Now the next thing we need to do is see if... No, JavaScript is not included. Maybe it is. Script. Okay, there it is. Script, JavaScript. Um, <clears throat> so the code highlighting is there. Now I'm going to take this piece of code from Code Academy. Really enjoying this. This is a, um, a model for how education could be done right, not only for coding, but for math, physics, biology, chemistry. This um, the, it, it has a great deal of potential great deal of promise and if you want to learn how to code this is a great place to start so I'm going to copy paste this code in here and look all of my why isn't it highlighted this should all be highlighted why isn't it highlighted I don't know why if you know why tell me I appreciate it thanks for watching and happy computing